Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. seems to be a situation in which he wants to do everything in his power to keep this fight on the feet. He'd appear to have a lot of advantages at distance. We'll see if he can get it done tonight. Yes, he has all the advantages. Oh! Fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. Oh, shades of Ben Saunders against Brandon Wolf back in the day. A lot of uh, knees, a lot of volume here. I'm not sure how many more he can take. My boy John Anik is a encyclopedia of knowledge and threw it all the way back. But those knees will definitely take a fact the longer this fight goes. Knees oh. hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. If you like Muay Thai striking, this might be your moment in this fight as he gets the tie clinch. This is a massive moment for this fighter. He is a great Muay Thai fighter. Look for him to go knee, knee, and then try to land a big one to the head. So a combination of knees here. You don't see this all the time where a fighter will, will throw multiple knees, but if it's not broken, they'll fix it. There's no takedown threat. If there was a takedown threat, he would not be throwing so many knees. But there's no threat of getting taken down, so he is just letting those knees fly. Double leg shot. And they separate. Ooh, big knee. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. And just misses with that big right hand. Big kick. Attempt with the right hand there. Whoa! And just like that, the fight is over. Holy smokes! What a fight! Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliana has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 45 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Magnifico! And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done.